Hi, third grade. This is lesson 21. It is our last week of school. So today we're going to review everything that we've learned in third grade, okay? The first two things are actually things you learned in second grade, but we've reviewed them in third grade. So tika tika, quadruple meter, which is when you have four beats and the first one is strong. Strong, weak, weak, weak. Strong, weak, weak, weak. Strong, right? We keep going. Um, and then these are things you learned in third grade, like ti tika and tika ti. We're gonna go over lo la. We're gonna go over lo so. We're gonna review internal upbeat and recorders, the most recent recent things we've done. Okay, so all these things we're doing today. So first, friends, let's go over tika tika. And the song we're gonna do actually is um, chicken on the fence post. So let's see. Na, na, na. Chicken on the fence post, one and two, and everyone sing. Chicken on the fence post, can't dance, Josie. Chicken on the fence post, can't dance, Jo. Chicken on the fence post, can't dance, Josie. Hello, Susan Brownie, yo. Now, do you know where the song, where in the song the tikka tikka is? Tikka tikka. If you know where in the song it is, I want you to stand up when we sing it. Ready? And chicken on the fence post, can't dance, Josie. Chicken on the fence post, can't dance, Josie. Chicken on the fence post, can't dance, Josie. Hello, Susan Brownie, yo. I'm gonna stand up with you so you know where it is. Ready? And here we go. Chicken on the fence post, can't dance, Josie. Chicken on the fence post, can't dance, Josie. Chicken on the fence post, can't dance, Josie. Hello, Susan Brownie, yo. Do you hear that? Tika tika. Those are four sounds over a beat, right? Then after that, we learned quadruple meter, which is when you have one strong beat and then three weak beats. So let's conduct it first, ready? Have our hands out like this, and you're gonna go a big one, in, out, up. And those are all weak, okay? Big one again. One, two, three, four. Big one, one. Two. Now, one isn't faster or slower. They're all the same speed. It's still a steady beat. It's just the one is stronger. So it's a little bit louder. Strong. Weak. 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 Strong. Weak. Weak. Keep going. We're going to sing Are You Sleeping, which is in quadruple meter. Strong, weak, 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 right? Two and ready. Here we go. Are you sleeping? Are you sleeping? Brother John. Keep going. Brother John. Morning bells are ringing. Morning bells are ringing. Ding, ding, dong. Ding. Do you feel that strong, weak, 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 weak? Do you feel that rhythm? Wait, great friends. Now we're gonna go over a song that we did this year called A Hogs in the Cornfield to go over our T-Tikas and our tika tees okay? Let's sing it once. A one and a two and a ready and go. Hogs in the cornfield, cows in the clover, tell them pretty cows I'm coming over. Hogs in the long, short, short. So that would be T Tika, right? Hogs in the cornfield, cows in the full clover. Tell them pretty cows, pretty cows, pretty cows are three sounds over a beat. Pretty cows, short, short, long. So that would be Tika T, right? Tell them pretty cows, I'm coming over. So the first one is hogs in the cornfield, hogs in the cornfield. T Tika T T. Tea, 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 cows in the clover. Tell them, pretty cows, I'm coming over. If you can do this with your fingers, try it. Ready? Here we go. Hogs in the cornfield, cows in the clover. Tell them, pretty cows, I'm coming. Do it again. Ready? Hogs in the cornfield, cows in the clover. Tell them, pretty cows, I'm coming over. Very nice, friends. Then the next song is. Oh. What is this? Ready? Big fat biscuit, do la do. Fresh from the oven, chew ba 
splash from the oven, do la do, boy jump over yonder, do la do. Remember, do and la is a skip, right? If um, here if I show you, sol fej street, we know that lots of notes have steps, like do and re is a step, right? Re and mi is a step, mi and so is a skip, so and la is a step. Do and Lola is a skip. So let's see here. Let me see if you can tell me where these notes go, okay? So is here. Where would me go? Here, right? Where is Ray? This is easy for you guys. You're in third grade, right? Very good. How about Do? Where is Do? Point to the screen. It's here, good. So la, regular la, so la, where is la? Oops. La is here, very good. Now, lo la, do la, where is lo la? Lo la is down here. Oops, sorry, I, don't, I almost did it. Cause do and la is a skip, right? So now let's use our hand signs for Jubalu. Ready? Big fat biscuit, do la do. Fresh from the oven, do la do. Boy, jump over yonder, do la do. Nice. Now there's another new note called Phoebe in her petticoat, right? And Phoebe in her petticoat. Mi, re, do, do, re, do, do, la. Phoebe in her gown is mi, re, do, do, so. Me, Phoebe in her petticoat, mi, re, do, do, re, do, do, la. Going round to town, so mi, mi, re, do. So if I sing a phrase, you're gonna echo with your hand signs, ready? Phoebe in her petticoat, your turn. Phoebe in her gown. Phoebe in her petticoat. Go ring round to town. Nice friends. If I were to sing you any phrase in this song or in another song, could you give me the hand signs of Solfege back? I'm gonna put Solfege Street down. I wanna see if you can do it without looking, okay? Oh, I wish I had someone to help me out. I can help you out! Oh, thank you, Jasmine. Hi, Jasmine. Yes, I can do it. I will sing. I will sing what you sing. Okay, great. Good. So if I sing Jasmine, Phoebe in her petticoat, Mi, Re, Do, Do, Re, Do, La, Phoebe in her gown, Mi, Re, Do, Do, So, how about this? Big fat biscuit jubilee. Do, do, re, mi, do, la, do. Fresh from the oven jubilee. Do, 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 re, mi, do, la, do. Chicken on the fence post can dance Josie. Do, 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 mi, re, mi, so. Chicken on the fence post can dance Josie. Do, 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 re, do, la, so. Chicken on the fence, post, can dance, Josie. Do, 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 me, re, me, so. Hello, Susan Brownie, yo. La, so, me, re, do, do, do. Very nice, Jason. Thank you. Now, can I try to help the friends at home? Yes, you can try. So, Jasmine's gonna sing. I'm gonna sing. And then you at home, are you gonna sing the hand signs, ready? Chicken on the fence, post, can dance, Josie. Chicken on the fence, post, can dance, Josie. Chicken on the fence, post, can dance, Josie. Hello, Susan Brownie, yo. Aha! Oh. You were helping them. I know, I know. I'm sorry. I won't, I'll stop. I won't do it. Ready? Hello, Susan Brownie, yo. How was that? All right, friends, very nice, good. So Jasmine, you're gonna sit down for a second. Okay. And we're gonna do um, internal upbeat. Remember, that's when a phrase 
starts not at the beginning of the beat, but right before. So if we do something like Old Mr. Rabbit, let's sing it once first. of jumping in the garden and eating all my cabbage. You see how the, the phrase starts right before the beat, right? What if we do the two things? We keep on drawing the phrases, but with your other hand, you can tap the beat with your hand. Let's see if it matches, right? Old Mr. Rabbit. Oh, sorry, I can do it. Ready again, here we go. Old Mr. Rabbit, you've got a mighty habit of jumping in the garden and eating all my cabbage. That's hard, right? Let's try it again. Here we go. Old Mr. Rabbit, you've got a mighty habit of jumping in the garden and eating all my cabbage. Oh my goodness. So that's like doing a hundred things at once, right? But do you see how old starts on the beat, right? Old Mr. Rabbit, but you've got You've got you is before. Old Mr. Rabbit, you've got a mighty habit of jumping in the garden and eating all my cabbage. Those other phrases, phrases two, three, and four, it's before the beat. So the internal upbeat is the upbeat or the phrase happens before the beat. And also, and not the beginning of the song. So it's internal, it's not the beginning, okay? Let's do it one more time. Ready? And go. Old Mr. Rabbit, you've got a mighty habit of jumping in the garden and eating all my cabbage, right? Very nice, friends. Good, good. So now we are going to do some recorders. Let's review some notes that we know, okay? So this right here is a B. A and G. If you want to get your recorder out, you can go ahead and get it. You can pause the video. Let's try it again, okay? B, A, G, what is this note when it's five in a row like that? It's an E, right? And then you still have your thumb down. If I have six in the front on your thumb, what is that? It's a D, right? Now, one of the last songs we did was Happy Birthday. So let me finger it for you and then we can try to play it. Ready? So we start here on D and it's like this. D, D, E, D. G, and then the new note we learned is F sharp. F sharp, which is like a D, but you lift your first finger. So it's one, two, three, skip this, and then these two fingers down here. Try it again. D, D, E, D, G, F sharp. Try it with me again, ready? D, D, E, D, G, F sharp, and you should not be playing. Don't play yet so you can hear me, okay? Just say the letters and finger it. Try it again. D, D, E, D, G, F sharp. The next phrase goes like this. D, D, E, D, A, G. Try that, go. D, D, E, D, a, G, try it again. Ready, and D, D, E, D, A, G. Can we try those two phrases together? Ready, and go. D, D, E, D, G, F sharp. D, D, E, D, A, G. How is that? Let's try it again and I'll do the next phrase. Okay, ready? D, D, E, D, G, F sharp. D, D, E, D, A, G. Now the next phrase goes like this. D, D, high D, which is just your second finger. No thumb, no right hand. So it's all six in the front and your thumb to just your second finger. D, D, high D. Right, I'm using this pinky just to balance, but I'm not holding any keys down, okay? 
If I didn't have my pinky there and had my mouth on it, then all I would need is just my thumb hold resting here and my second finger. So low D, 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 high D, B, G, F sharp, E. That's a hard phrase, okay? Try it again. D, D, high D, B, G, F sharp, E. Try it again. Low D. D, D, high D, B, G, F sharp, E. Try to do it without me saying it. Ready? Low D. Go. Let's try the first three phrases, then we'll do the last phrase, okay? So starting from the beginning, ready? D, D, E, D, G, F sharp, D, D, E, D, A, G, D, D, high D, B, G, F sharp, E. The last phrase goes like this, ready? C, C, which is your second finger and thumb, C, C, B, G, A, G. That's it. All right, last phrase. Here we go. C, C, B, G, A, G. One more time now. C, C, B, G, A, G. All right, let's try to finger the whole song first, then we will play it. Okay, ready? Starting with your low D, go. D, D, E, D, G, F sharp, D, D, E, D, A, G, D, D, high D, B, G, F sharp, E, now C, 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 B, G, A, G. All right, ready to play it? Here we go. D. Low D, high D. Sorry. High D, B. Ready to go. Now C. Alright friends, keep practicing that. We have learned so much in third grade this year. Um, I'm gonna have a little goodbye message um, down in the description and in the Google Classroom, so I'll say bye then, okay? Bye everybody!